back. It's Teresa, your MWR events coordinator. Today we're going to be doing some Valentine's Day cupcakes and ones with a little surprise on the inside. So the first thing we're actually going to start off with is we're going to use a white cake mix as the base and you can use whatever cake mix you want. I'm actually just using a box cake mix today. Just makes it a little bit easier. Um, so we're actually, let's just start our ingredients. Some oil, and if you have a better um, at-home cake mix, I definitely suggest using that. Um, it's definitely what I do, my little secret recipe that I have. So now we're just gonna stir this all up, get our batter going here. All right, once we get that nice and stirred, the way that I like to pour it in my cupcake liners is actually through a measuring cup. So the cupcake liners that we're using today are actually called tulip cupcake liners. I find them on Amazon. Um, I really like them. I just think they spice up your cupcakes a little bit better. They make them look a little nicer. Uh, but you can use whatever you want. Um, doesn't have to be the tulip ones. I'm gonna put this in. Now with the special surprise that we're putting in the middle, I'll show that in a second. Um, we want to make sure that because we are using these tulip cupcake liners that we're actually not filling it all the way up to the top. Um, so we're actually only going to put a very small amount in. Um, and you will see in a second here what I mean by very small amount. And I mean like a half an inch to maybe an inch. I'm going to put that in there. So now it comes to what we're gonna actually put inside of the cupcake. So I actually made a red velvet uh, sheet cake. Um, and what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna use this little heart. We're gonna make 12 hearts out of this sheet cake. And then what we're gonna do is we're actually gonna take them out and we're gonna put them in the middle of the cupcake. So when you open it up, it's a heart inside. So what I do or what I suggest on doing is when you bake your sheet cake, go ahead and put it in the freezer for a little bit. It just makes it a little bit easier to get out. Um, and then these come out a little bit more firmer when you cut them. So this is what the middle of the cupcake is actually going to look like. It's a nice little heart and we're going to put it inside the white cupcake mix. So now that we have our little hearts cut out, we're going to actually put them inside. Now the trick to this to make sure that you're putting it in correctly, so when you cut into it and you open the cupcake up, it actually looks like a heart. So you want them facing all the same direction. So if you take your heart and we're going to face it, you know, left or right, so we're going to put it right inside and we're going to push it down. So cake obviously rises. Um, so we want to make sure that it's pushed all the way down because when that cake actually rises, it's going to push this heart up a little bit. So we actually want to make sure that that doesn't happen because it won't look like a heart when you cut into it. All right, so now that we have all of our hearts in and they're all going the same direction, we're going to go stick it in the oven and uh, let that cook out. guys now that our cupcakes have come out of the oven we're actually going to start decorating um, so first we're going to do some icing you could do any icing that you want I just chose a simple buttercream um, chocolatey vanilla flavor uh, for these ones so um, and I like to use a fun piping tip um, but you can honestly just use whatever floats your boat we're just gonna make like a simple one we're gonna go all the way around and then right up to the top same thing with all of them. All right, so once you've frosted your cupcakes, um, 
The fun thing is, is to decorate them. And the key is to decorate them after you put the frosting on. You need to remember which way your hearts were going. So I face mine all leading this way. So a trick to do is to find whatever, you know, decoration that you want to do and kind of do it like a little sideways decoration so you know which way to cut into the uh, cupcake. So I put mine on the sides so I know to cut right down in between these two hearts. And then let's see, we can do some like little candy hearts. Something fun for Valentine's Day. Maybe a little Ghirardelli chocolate. And I know if I put it down this way, I know to go right down the middle. Or we can do these hearts on one side with a little sprinkle of red on the other. So I know I'm gonna go right down the middle. So now let's cut into our cupcake and see what it looks like. Oh, look at that perfect heart shaped center. <laughs> so much guys uh this looks beautiful i kind of hate to uh almost hate to cut anything <laughs> so, so nice but uh i'm gonna give it a try i'm gonna cut the i'm gonna get half the calories now <laughs> and uh oh my goodness look at that how did you get a heart inside this that is beautiful you gotta hit like and subscribe to find out how to read it. Okay, I will. <laughs> that is beautiful. Thank you, Pete. That's a nice job. Happy Valentine's Day, guys. I hope you have a great weekend. Enjoy your loved ones. And don't forget to like and subscribe and join us next week for our next video. Until then, see you later.